Baby sister here. This is Amy. We're gonna call her baby girl. She's the baby girl of how many girls? Five girls. Five. Oh my. Okay, so we have a cousin who has a ranch with horses. So we're gonna do something fun. We're gonna make some horse treats. We have our fun ingredients here already. Let's see them. Let's see. We have our three cups of oats here. Everything is organic, but this is definitely stuff that we're gonna be eating as well. We have a half cup of flour. We got our applesauce and I drizzled it with a little bit of cinnamon. Eh, eh, eh. Okay, we have our carrots here. Horses love carrots, right? We also have our apples. We have our apples. Mm-hmm. And we also have what's gonna actually hold everything together is the honey and the coconut oil. So let's go ahead and mix our dry ingredients. Come on up, there, there I am. <laughs> okay, so baby girl, why don't you go ahead and pour in our three cups of oats? Got our oats, y'all. Oh. And me. <laughs> oh, look at the oats and her. <laughs> Good. And we're gonna also add our half cup of flour. Our dry ingredients always go first. We mix dry first when baking. We're gonna go ahead and stir that up. We get our wooden spoon. Y'all, our grandmother used to beat us with these. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we're gonna mix this up. Yeah. Now we're gonna go ahead and add our apple sauce. Apple, apple sauce. sauce is so good. Apple sauce. Is it? Is yeah. apple sauce good? Apple sauce is delicious. I guess if you like apple sauce, it's good. We're gonna mix that in. Mix it. Give a little, give a little um something when you mix. Give a little, so give a little something when you mix. Give a little something when you mix. Now, big sister is gonna add these carrots. We're gonna add some carrots up in there. Now, this, these again, these are horse treats. We're gonna make these for our horses. We want you guys to come with us when we feed the horses as well. That's gonna be some fun. We're gonna have some fun. Yeah, mix all that together. We're gonna make them, we're gonna roll them up into little balls and then we're gonna put them on our baking sheet and we're gonna let them bake for about 15 minutes. And then we're gonna pull them bad boys out. You're gonna ride with us to the ranch and we're gonna watch our horses eat them. Oh, that looks good already. Let's mix these apples up in there. There's nothing better than apple and cinnamon together. I think they best friends. That's how baby girl likes to eat her oatmeal, right? Real bad. <laughs> <laughs> Apples and cinnamon and, is that the only fruit you like in yours? Um, it's the only thing I'll be eating oatmeal, yes. Okay. Ooh, that looks really good and it smells good too. Mm, smell that honey. <clears throat> we got coconut oil and honey, okay? Very important to have them both. Very important to make sure you have them both, okay? Listen to your teacher. Teachers. Teacher, excuse me. Good. The fun part is actually rolling them up into balls. And I know your kids would love to do that as well. If that's the part that you don't want to get your hands dirty. Your hands dirty. Okay, if you don't want to get your hands dirty, have your kids do it. Make your kids do it. That's why baby girl here, she gonna get them hands dirty. Okay. Oh, everything's all mixed together. Trying to make sure that coconut oil everywhere, mm -hmm. got honey everywhere. Mm -hmm. Good. Do you, have you ever been in the kitchen cooking before? Yeah. What do you cook? What you um, cook? I mean, I've made greens before. And okay. Did mom teach you that? Not Mom, really. I just kind of put the seed, we put the greens in the pot, and I threw in whatever seasonings we had out. Threw some greens in the pot, and whatever <laughs> seasoning goes in there. Yeah. And <laughs> they came out delicious. I'm gonna have to taste them greens that came out delicious. Oh, that's ball. Is it time to ball? I think so. Time to ball. We're gonna take some. Oh, it don't matter. I don't think it really matters. I think like so. Cookies? 
Just like these. Let me show you. Look at this. This is going to be for our horses. Oh, they're going to love them. But before we let our horses eat them, we will definitely try them first, okay? To make sure they come out okay. Before we try to feed them to anybody else. Very important. <laughs> you will get sued. Oh, we don't need that. We ain't got no money. That's why we're doing this audition tape, okay? <laughs> okay. I wonder about how many of these were made. A lot. Those were good. Your balls look good. Tinks, tinks. Good. It kind of looks like coleslaw. I think it's just the... The shredded carrots remind you of coleslaw. Do you like coleslaw? That's a no. No, we don't, we don't like coleslaw. We don't like that. Allie, we got another sister here who's in charge of recording. We got another sister. Hello. That's Allie. Hey, Allie. Thank you, Allie. I'm the one who set this up as filming, you know, just behind the scenes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Abby. Allie, you got some trivia questions for us? I sure some do. Some fun for us? I sure do. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. If y'all know your stuff for real. Let's check out our dresses. Right now. Cute. <laughs> You gotta look good good in the kitchen in order for your food to be good too. Did y'all know this? Did y'all know this? (laughs) Y'all ready for these questions? Yes! Yes. Okay. Yes, let's see what we got. Okay, okay. It says, what vegetable is used to make pickles? Which vegetable is known to make people cry when they cut it? Gunions. <laughs> Onions. <laughs> okay. It's a it good says, one. Okay, what is the name of the food that is made by bees using nectar from flowers? Honey. Perfect. <laughs> okay, what is the B for BLT? Well, what's the B stand for for Bacon. Bee? Wait, BLT? <laughs> Bacon, lettuce, tomato. Hey, there you go. There you go. B. This is B in sign language. L. And T. <laughs> okay, let's see if you know this. Uh-oh. What is the main ingredient in hummus? Ooh. You don't know that, do you? <laughs> hummus? I don't even like hummus. <laughs> chickpeas. And there you go. There you go. Y'all like chickpeas? I love chickpeas. I'm not the hugest fan, but I low-key could eat some hummus. Like, really? Yeah. So you can eat it if grind it up, but not whole. Yeah, I think so. Okay, which fruit is known for its high vitamin C? Oranges. Mm-hmm. Yes. Perfect. Orange like your dress. Orange <laughs> like your dress. <laughs> okay. Chi-town is known Chicago. for its deepest yeah. pizza. Yeah. I didn't know that. That's really. So that's where we need to go. Facts. Chi-town, we coming in. <laughs> wow, I didn't know this either. It says, what is the most widely eaten fruit? Like worldwide. Then potatoes. I feel like that. So like, that's your start. That's your start. This <laughs> yeah. is the aftermath. Look beautiful, at her beautiful, beautiful perfect beautiful, horse treats. Mm-hmm. How much the horse say? Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> They're going in the oven for about 15 minutes. And then class, we'll come back. We'll come back. We'll come back. <gasps> we shall we'll return. Back. Oh, we about to swatter. Okay, we're getting ready to get our horse treats out. Again, they were in the oven for about 15 minutes. Ooh la la. Ooh. Okay. We're gonna try one before we wrap them up and take them to the ranch today. Yeah. I am a little nervous, okay. Mmm. 
smells like cinnamon. It just smells good. Smell like applesauce. No way. It smells really good. Yeah, it kind of smells like. So we're gonna cut into it. We're gonna break into it. Take it the heat. You can kind of see the smell. We did yeah, you it. Can't see the smell. Oh, they're not even hot. Not the hot. Oh, that's not bad at all. Not at all. That's very good. Oh yeah. It kind of tastes like apple sauce. It's apple. It's apple. And <laughs> apple and cinnamon are best friends. You can never go wrong with them. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Never ever. That's real good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's wrap these. Uh, we got this. Beautiful horses here. Hello. Yeah. I love them. Oh, that's good pup. That's good horsey. Oh, yay. Here. Here. Oh, they love them. That makes me so happy. Can they want them? Oh, eat them up. Eat them up. Hi. Hi. <laughs> wow. Oh, my. <laughs> Hi, baby. I think, and we have more horses coming. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. We're going to try to feed everybody. We're going to try to feed everyone. We want the little one. They're being stingy, not sharing with the baby. Share with the baby. Okay. Oh, I got one to the baby. You got one to the baby? Yeah. Oh, good. Oh, look, they looking. They looking. They looking. Here, baby. Hi. Oh. <laughs> oh. Look at these. Hmm. These tomatoes are going to be perfect. We want to find the ones that are nice and plump. You guys, be perfect. Thank you. Sure. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Our brown beef, again from the farmer's market. Mm -hmm. Ice cream scooper. Get perfect little balls. And get the best balls like this, right? And then when you scoop them down, like this, it comes out to the perfect little meatball, right? But we're gonna add some mozzarella. To it. I did. Add some mozzarella to it. Get another little scoop. We have the perfect little meatball. The perfect. Perfecto. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna do this. How many ever times we need? Get all go. Scoop. Get it out. Let's add the mozzarella again. The inside of the meatball. Mmm. We're gonna get a little more to cover the top. Like so. There we go. And we're gonna do this a few times and then we're gonna put them in the oven. And then we'll be back. Olive oil. I guess. So we got, this is what our marinara sauce is going to consist of. There's mm. some garlic and onion and tomatoes. And olive oil. Olive oil, some pepper. Clean, easy drizzle. Generous amount. Generous amount. Yep. Good. Good. Generous. Good. Good amount. Yeah. Sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. Mm -hmm. I'm going to mix it up a little bit. <laughs> Alright. Let's add this to the oven. Now we already have our meatballs in. So we're just going to add it to the side. 
Ooh. I don't know if y'all can hear that. Oh, that sound good. <laughs> I'm so excited. All right, we're just gonna add this here to the bottom. Just to give it time to, again, loosen up a little bit. Then we're gonna add it to our food processor. Then we're gonna blend it up. Class, we're gonna come right back. Don't go. So remember, we put our tomatoes and our onion and our garlic in the oven to loosen it up for our marinara sauce. Look at that. You guys have no idea how good this smells right now. It smells magnificent. So we're gonna go ahead and pour it in our food processor. Baby girl's gonna have to help a big ditcher out because I'm struggling. Okay. There's probably a smarter way to do this, but hey. We don't know. So we don't know it. So we gonna do what we can. We're gonna do what we do. Dump it. Get it, get it, scoop it, scoop it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Come say. That's and it's hot. Mmm. And it's mm. hot. That's <laughs> good. Mmm. Mmm. I need the rest of that. <laughs> yeah, that's really good. It's amazing. Yeah, that's really good. That's really good. Okay, yeah. Mmm. Mm -hmm. It's good though. Yeah, meatball. You tasted the meatball? Mm -hmm. I haven't even tasted my meatball yet. Wait, let me taste the meatball. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Let's taste that meatball. Mm, and the sauce. Mm. <gasps> you tasted the meatball? You did? It's good. It's mm. nice, like cooked. Mmm. Is it moist? Yes. It's like it's so good. All of this. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. Oh, y'all don't know. Here, have some. Eat it up. <laughs> let me blow in it for you. <laughs> and then let me eat it for you. Let me taste it for you. That, that is a good meatball. Yeah. That's a real good meatball. Miss Stone did her thing. We're going to eat well this. Done. Thank you, baby girl. Thank you, Allie. Thank you, everybody who's watching. If you choose, that's great. If you don't, mm -hmm. oh, well. that's okay, too. Bye.